All right, so just wanted to show you guys, this is uh, the beginning of the next part or, or uh, video uh, in the body lift on Red Rebel. Um, the shifter linkage that they show here, this is inside the wheel well, the driver's side wheel well, uh, it didn't come with this plate. And it says that it's only for pivot bracket for 2002 models. But it's actually, my truck's a 2000 and it has that setup. Now it says for automatic shift linkages for uh, to extend the rod for 98 um, to 2001. It didn't come with this plate and I'm kind of pissed off. I tried contacting performance accessories or daystar and they won't contact me back so i made my own plate it's kind of ugly but uh i drilled these holes this hole's kind of big because it wasn't quite centered but this is where it bolts to the body right here up top and the wheel well and then here is where the bracket bolts in now i drilled those and i tapped those and the reason why i tapped them is because there's not enough room to put a nut on the back side it's too close to the body so i'm going to, have to cut these bolts down once i cut these bolts down to the right length then uh we'll be good to go so but all these are tapped and just put a washer on each one with a lock lock washer and then they just thread in there so after i cut these bolts down we'll be back to you guys here in a minute to show you guys the results all right so we're out here with the bracket guys and the bracket bolts up like this. This is inside the front wheel well. Here's the tire, the back side of the wheel well. Oh, well, we already got the stock holes are already tapped, are already threaded holes. So we'll throw those in. Where's the other one? Now back behind here because these bolts I mean you could get shorter bolts you could cut them down but uh, I didn't feel like messing with it so all I did is because this is so close this doesn't thread in far enough to tighten this down and then I also used bigger bolts so I had to drill the holes out on the bracket bigger so the bolts could fit in there and I made them a little bit bigger than they need to be so there's room for movement because uh, again, this isn't this is a homemade plate with them drilled and tapped, so it's not the greatest. But behind here, I'll show you because the fender well is right there. I just drilled holes so the bolt can pass through. So a lot of you guys are gonna argue with me, maybe say it's a that's a bullshit half-ass job. But uh, again, this is just a homemade job. I'm trying to get this thing done. Um, I can always go back and get the actual plate later, but this one works just fine. I don't see why it won't. So um, we're gonna get her all bolted up and we'll be back in a minute. All right guys, so here's the finished results. Again, these were are the this was the stock location. This is the new location. Now I did not measure the exact length i know it's a three inch these are three inch spacers or three inch body body spacers so it's a three inch body lift as you guys know uh but uh i did not uh i didn't mess with anything uh i didn't bother measuring i guarantee this isn't three inches i mean it might be i just kind of just threw this together this is a plate that i happen to have laying around and i just cut it out um again i threaded the bottom ones and then i drilled holes in the back side so the bolts could pass through and there's your end result so it's all bolted up and it's good to go just got to adjust the shifter linkage so it shifts correctly and then we're good to go. So just real quick before my, my uh, camera dies, even though I put this plate on here, this rod, shifter rod, still needs to be extended because it's, it's as far down as it can go and it only makes it to reverse. So when it says it's in park, it's in reverse. And when it says it's in reverse, it's in neutral. And I can't go any farther down, so this rod needs to be cut and extended now they supply the rod to do that the problem is though is if you don't have a welder you're kind of screwed so uh, we'll 
we'll be back with uh, extending this rod.